Nintendo came through the door and put the system on the market. But a lot of programmers were still doing everything they could to make sure that Virtual Boy owners could enjoy a number of good games, like the Four Kings of the Virtual Boy collection in Japan. The Virtual Lab was sent to Japan in very small quantities in December 1995. Everything in this game seems to indicate that it was a hurry to get the game out of the door before Virtual Boy's production and distribution lines were closed once in for Al. The Rare Virtual Boy Game, which is actually as bad as the system's reputation. Many thanks to Chris Kohler, who made the game a success and spent a probably ungodly amount on an absolute pile of junk so it could be documented here. It wasn't really a good system. But as we saw at Virtual Boy Works, it wasn't as bad as the system's reputation led us to believe. In fact, it's as bad as the collective consciousness expected of a Virtual Boy game. And that makes the Virtual Lab a valuable gem in the game. Everyone hates Virtual Boy, but Nintendo's most failed game company has gone down in history as a simple bag of sand. The good news is that I've given you a fairly complete picture so you never have to go through it on your own. In fact, it's so awful that the creator doesn't even seem to have finished programming it yet. From the bottom of my heart and Chris you're welcome. Please enable JavaScript to see the comments supported by disks.